Hello everybody, Panama City Beach gumbo ideas. I was cooking yesterday after going to our local fisher market on the east side of town, but we do have a fish market on the west side of town too. And there's Buddy Gandy's and Gandy's, and both of them are excellent local fishermen families that we should support. Instead of going to big box retailers, let's support our local fishing industry. They bring in fresh fish every day and shrimp and um, I wish we had some uh, garden swaps where we could also go and get fresh produce on our Saturdays and Sundays through some sort of a swap meet, but I don't know where our local fish, um, our produce markets are besides the grocery store. We used to have some produce markets down off of Beck Avenue at the marina there, and then also Captain Anderson's used to have a uh, produce market where people would bring their local wares. So hopefully that'll be something to resurge the recipes hope you can read it uh, four onions about medium size or small onions three peppers smaller or uh, medium and more okra the merrier I bought two packages from uh, Winn-Dixie I'd use two to three cans of tomato paste and two large cans of stewed tomatoes be sure and chop up the tomatoes as you throw them in the pot and then four cups of water add uh, three large fillets of white fish you could add shrimp, you can add crab, you could add uh, different sausages, you know, just whatever you got in the kitchen, throw it in the pot and be sure and add four cups of water to that. Just to, um, you know, you can dilute gumbo. It tends to get thicker as, as you make it, but always easy peasy. And then serve it with a side of fresh steamed rice. I use the jasmine rice with the elephant logo and always put a good pat of uh, Land Lakes salted butter. So, Bon appetit, and let's shop local, eat more fish at least twice to three times a week in your diet, and uh, nix the pork and the beef. Eating pork and beef is really nothing is good about it. A pig is a diabetic animal, and high subcutaneous fat levels, and a cow, they're just very sweet. I hate to see any of those animals um, cooked. So, hope you'll eat more of our fish, and uh, just enjoy. And I hope you like my recipe.